hello everyone so welcome back to an other video so in this video we are going to discuss about an ayurvedic medicine which is called nelly thylam so we are going to discuss the benefits how to use this thylam and also the ingredients let's get started in case if you want to buy this product the link is in the description and let's get started before we start let's see for what this has been used for this is actually used to treat a scalp infection, dandruff, skin disorders and inside bites. So in case if you are uh, experiencing any of this, let's get started with the benefits. Let's talk about the benefits of Nelly Thylam hair oil. So Nelly Thylam, as I said, it is used for uh, scalp infections, treat dandruff and other any scalp complications and promotes the growth of your new hair so in case if you have any hair fall you're going to use this thylam in case if you don't have any like you there is no growth of your hair use this thylam in in order to uh, grow new hairs and also it is also uh, used to treat severe premature gearing and also promotes hair development so and uh, nelly thylam hair oil helps to improve volume and suppliness as, as well nelly thylam uh, is also used for in order to treat uh, skin allergies skin disease and also any poisonous bites by the insects chloric skin diseases so in case if you have any you can go ahead and use uh, the thylam in case if you want to treat uh, like uh, consult your doctor you can also do that and regarding uh, the ingredients uh, I've posted in the description because we have a lot of ingredients in this medicine so go through the description and that's the benefits and also there's a link in the description in order to buy and also I've written a full article on this product so that if you want to go through it you can anytime let's see how to use this product in order to use this product it's very simple and easy so you just need to apply uh, this oil on your scalp and hair or on your skin uh, in, in condition of inside bites or infection or uh, as your doctor says 